Good morning, good morning guys. Yeah, we're here on the fuel island here, still at that quick trip here in Toma, Wisconsin. We just finished cleaning our windshield here. Now we're ready to get out of here. Yeah, we cleaned our front lights and windshield and side windows and mirrors and the whole nine yard. Inspected everything, everything looks good, so we're gonna get out of here. That's right. I was just looking at this truck here earlier already when he, uh, when I got out to inspect my tractor and trailer. I mean, look at all the black smoke and soot that he's got on his trailer. That's from his exhaust. Man, oh man, I, he must have gone through quite a few gallons of oil. That's what it looks like. Wow, that is bad. But yeah. We're gonna get out of here, gonna get, uh, hit the interstate. We kind of wasted way too much time in here, but whatever. We uh, had a good time off here and went ahead and did a little shopping here this morning. Turn left and then keep to the left in 200 feet. So that way I got me some uh, bread and Sandwich meat and all that good stuff in here again. Got some tomatoes, some cheese, and all that good stuff. So that way we can make our own sandwiches in the truck again. Figured, you know, up there further east, there ain't too many truck stops up there, and we're probably going to be stuck sitting somewhere at a rest area. And they generally just have like fast food restaurants like McDonald's, Burger King, and stuff like that. I don't really like that too much, so I figured may as well get me some sandwich meat and all that good stuff, so I'd much rather have a sandwich instead of uh, having me a Burger King or something like that, right? But yeah, here we are getting on the interstate. I know it's already quarter after nine, but whatever. We have 1,200 miles to go. <clears throat> and basically two and a half days to do it in, so figured whatever. I don't really have to drive 600 miles today. We can actually do probably 500 miles today and still be all right. But yeah, this part of the highway they just redid here not too long ago, so it's nice and smooth again. <coughs> Sunday already. Wow. September 4th. That's right. I think we might go up to South Beloit and then uh, fuel up the truck over there. Yep. We might just do that. That way we got cheaper fuel over here and we have to fuel less further east, right? Because the further east you go, the more money the fuel gets. Or we could fill up in Ohio. It's not bad prices over there either, but we'll see what we decide on. But yeah, should be in uh, Chicago there right around lunchtime, so that will work out perfect. We won't have to worry too much with rush hour traffic, I would think, especially since today is Sunday. Everybody's going to start coming back tomorrow, I would think. So it shouldn't be too bad today. Because it's a long weekend, right? So tomorrow everybody's probably coming back from going on their trips or whatever. So tomorrow is probably going to be crazy traffic. So anyways, we'll continue cruising along there. We appreciate you guys tuning in today. So let's stick around for the Trump or Rudy show for the rest of the day. And we'll have ourselves a fantastic Sunday together. All right, guys. We're here at the rest area on Belvedere. Illinois so what we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and go around and check our tires a little bit and stuff like that make sure everything looks good that's what we're supposed to do throughout our trip go ahead and check everything look over everything a little bit make sure everything is good right and I did see a cop just pull in over there so I'm gonna go ahead and take a look and see if he's uh, actually pulled behind somebody or not but I see him go out that way 
or go that way anyway so i don't know where he went but he went that way anyways but yeah just looking at everything over here you know it's a little windy out here but not too bad just gonna go around and check all my tires make sure they're good and then we'll get out of here so uh yeah it looks like we got another truck pulling in right here right now but uh yeah anyways we'll go ahead and check all our tires and yeah he's pulling in right here beside me that's fine no big deal right we're just doing our regular check walk around here and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, make me a couple of sandwiches and grab me a bite to eat so we'll be right back y'all here we go guys i told you i was gonna go ahead and make me some sandwiches yeah so we're gonna have us a few sandwiches and get out of here all right guys let's get out of here i think we spent enough time in this rest area well we just did our half an hour pretty much that's what we did in here we just had our half an hour break and now it's time to get out of here get back on the interstate and get to chicago that's right and we just talked to somebody earlier today and uh, it's a good chance we will meet up with somebody this afternoon so let's go ahead and make our way that way and uh, we'll see what happens but uh, yeah my wife is saying that it is pouring rain up there in Manitoba right now that's what she was telling me just coming down like crazy. And hey, that's the way it is sometimes. <clears throat> sometimes you get nice sunny days and the next day you get pouring rain. Well, as long as it's not snow just yet, right? Then uh, that's all I care about. <laughs> I don't want to see snow just yet. Hey, it looks like we are getting some clouds too, so we might be getting some rain here ourselves. That wouldn't surprise me. But yeah, we're going to make our way towards Chicago. I am now in Indiana on the I-80 Toll Highway. We just turned on to the Toll Highway up here, so guess what we gotta go through a toll booth in order to go on a toll highway right <laughs> yeah that seems to be a fact they want their money of course they do what else would be new they want their money but their road is terrible right <laughs> that makes sense right that yeah, makes perfect sense i would say all the way on the outside here it says easy pass only and we got an easy pass so uh let's go through here and let's take care of it yeah let's see if they'll give us a green light there we go we got the green light there at the last second there but here we are now we are uh, we can say we are officially on the uh Indiana Turnpike yes indeed and as I think I mentioned earlier we're planning on meeting up with somebody up here in Indiana so we got another hour and 15 minutes to go till we get there so uh, so yeah we're through Chicago already that was pretty smooth sailing through there it's like I suspected because we were in there pretty early so uh, I suspected that we would be getting uh, through there pretty smoothly and we did it so I'm happy about that so let's put the hammer down and uh, let's go over there to a place up here on this toll highway and then let's hope we can meet up with somebody that yeah, would be kind of nice Lately, it seems like almost every trip I've been meeting up with somebody. <laughs> but it is nice though. I mean, I do have a lot of followers and some of you guys like to meet up with me and some of you don't really care, I guess. But 
most of you guys I would imagine wouldn't mind meeting up with me including myself I would like to meet up with me <laughs> nah, I can't do that right so but yeah so last pretty much long weekend in this year where it's gonna be warm enough to where you can go camping pretty much We'll have a few more long weekends, but uh, that'll be winter time by then. So, enjoy while we can. It's been a beautiful day for me. It's been very nice and warm. The wife is saying it's pretty uh, cloudy and, and dark and raining and drizzling. And JP was saying it was only like plus five this morning in Calgary. Like oh wow you know that's almost freezing point zero is freezing point so because that's Celsius right so yeah it's starting to get cold up there so you know it's coming our way that's for sure but anyways let's continue on cruising along here and let's go over there to uh, to this place and uh, we'll see if we can meet up with these people here we go guys. This is the town that we're going into to meet somebody. Yeah, let's go see if we can find a place where we have uh, a range to meet up at. Let's see what will happen. See if we can find us a parking spot in there and all that good stuff. Yep, I know somebody that's been here. Actually, I know two people that's been here already. Angie and Chuck have been here. And I know Trucker Jukebox has been down here and now I'm going to be down here. Oh wow, that was an interesting car <laughs> going by there. Well yeah, we're going to go down there to Callahan. That's what it supposedly is called. It's supposed to be a restaurant. Right beside the restaurant there's supposed to be a big empty parking lot. It's supposed to be able to go in there and park in there and then uh, Approaching destination in a half mile on the left side. So we'll go down there and see if we can find it. Alrighty guys, here we are at Callahan's Family Dining Restaurant right here. Let's go inside and see. I don't think they're here yet, so let's just go inside and find out. Here they come guys. Look at that. <laughs> let's go check in with them. Let's go say hi to them. That's right. Uh, Said he needed help, you know, so I subscribed to him. And you know, I uh, watched the first video that we showed. Mm -hmm. And, you know, he made me laugh, you know, and you know, like I say, you know, it's gonna be a good one. Yeah. But uh, I went to check out the second video mm -hmm. and it was Who's, who channel was that? I, I'm thinking it was on, uh, his thing is up underneath uh, Angie's and Chuck's video that, oh, that was up okay. this morning. Oh, I see. And you guys want to have a bite to eat? No, that's okay. Um, no, we're going to go have some supper. Uh, Ruin that, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, but, uh, do we know what we want? Just the drink. I'm going to have the Angus burger there. Hamburger or cheeseburger? Yeah. Hamburger, I would say. Yeah. 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 What's the difference between them? One just got cheese and the other one yeah. don't? No, I, I'll take the I take the one with cheese. Yeah. Okay. It comes with soup. We got green chicken, rice, and French onions. Yeah, yeah. I'm just having one. Okay. They gotta eat supper yet with their family, so oh, I'm right. from out of town, so okay. eating up for a little bit. Uh, Clinton. Clinton County. I don't know something like that. Yeah. But it's a young guy. Yeah. And 
the no, first I don't one like I that. like, but that had too much. Every but once in a while is okay, but not so much. I, right? I thought, well, you know, I anytime I subscribed, you know, I always stayed. I never, even if I didn't like or yeah. never went back to see another one, I never yeah. unsubscribed. And yeah. I, I won't unsubscribe. Yeah. I'll certainly never ever watch it again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. And it surprised me that, you know, Chuck and Angie, you know, have, had recommended the record, you know, they know him, I guess, because okay. he's from, from there. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I don't know. It just surprised me that they would recommend somebody that, you know, that's the only word they knew how to say. Wow, wow, no, no, no. No, I don't like that either. Did you watch my uh, celebration video yet? The two year celebration video? When would it have been up? Uh, a couple of days ago. Let's see here. Uh, actually a day ago. It was Friday evening when I released it. Um, okay. yes. Well then that should have been what, would have, what I would have watched Saturday morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This Saturday morning. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I know there uh, there is one from the day before. Oh. That I didn't get because oh, okay. I noticed that when I when I watched that one, you know, there was still one there instead of the day ago. So yeah, yeah, yeah. That's probably oops, probably this one here with the uh, so that would be, would be the one for Friday. That's the two-year celebration video. Um. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah. Right. Um, Put a lot of clips but together. I, I have to be because I had to microwave this because it wasn't right. very hot. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then whoever pops up, you know, mm -hmm. the first between uh, Trucker Josh, uh, <laughs> you, mm -hmm. or, or Larry. Yep. Uh, those, you guys, you four, just counting Angie and Joe, are the ones, you know, I, I catch first thing in the morning. It's on the bottom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and, uh, then I go and play some games, and then I go back in, and then I try to catch Allie and, oh, yeah. and uh, Jay and John. Huh? I don't like that soup. Uh, so. Yeah, Ali hasn't released a video in a good while. I mean, she just uh, the released last one. one. The last one that I, I saw was when she was at the truck show. Yeah, she just released one here a few minutes ago. About a half an hour ago, so you'll probably see that later on when you get home. Uh, I used to follow... Uh, I think it was TJ in Sweden. Oh, okay. I, I I used to follow him every, every day. Okay. Uh, when he he was uh, delivering fuel or, or whatever, but he's doing yeah. something else now. And yeah. Let me tell you, <laughs> the he he was in a truck the first one. Where the wheel is on the op mm -hmm. opposite side, yeah. Opposite side. No, it was on the same side. When I'm looking at it, it's on the same side as us. Okay. Well, then he got put into a different truck for the steering wheel from this side. Oh. Right. <laughs> and, and let me tell you, it, it, it got to where there's a little shit off the beat. And, and he goes so fast, and they got those turnabouts, and yeah, that's scary. That. 
Shared the video on uh, Facebook uh, from, yes, I from, did. from some of uh, from the other guys that had uploaded yeah, the it. Other, the yeah, the other, it was the other guy, yeah. and then I, I watched yours this yeah. morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was three three other YouTubers that yeah. we met o- over there. That was last Sunday. Yeah, that would have been today's yeah. video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's what I saw. Yeah, drive shut through. Time on the line. Yeah, right. Donkey. <laughs> but yeah, those shish kebabs or whatever you call them, those were the Oh, they were very good. I never <laughs> had had meat like that before. You know, it was really good. Yeah, no, it's actually a nice place here. I've I've been through here so many times, but you can't see this place from the harbor, right? right? So. I noticed they even got a Texas uh, Roadhouse there. Yep, they got Texas Roadhouse, Applebee's. Yeah, I saw that, yeah, Applebee's. It would be nice to even park here and just walk over there to the Texas Roadhouse. Yeah. I love steak, you know. Oh my so. gosh. <laughs> yeah, I, I know that. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, that's a good possibility. I mean, after we deliver up there in Clinton, that we <laughs> might go back to Toronto. Oh, it's wow. Been a, been a few weeks now, so... I'm going to go out of a steak. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> right. <laughs> I appreciate you guys taking the time. You're welcome. Me. Yeah. Yeah, he called, Larry called me up and asked what I was doing. I said I had to go help uh, clean Carol's house and stuff. And I did that and things. And, um, and then that's when you guys said about four hours. So. Yeah. Well, I was still on the other side of Chicago, so... Yeah, Wisconsin. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And around here, you never know how 
I know. Oh. It's hectic. Well, they really need to fix the interstate in the summer, especially here a little bit before it's really. Rough. I know. Larry wasn't joking. Yeah. 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 It sure is. I'm gonna drive a few hours yet today, and then uh, we'll see from there. Still got a good ways to go up to Clinton yet. So. Five twenty-one right now. Yeah. Oh. Let's see here how far it is up to Clinton, but I think it's a little wide. Clinton, Michigan? Oh, uh, no. oh Massachusetts. Yeah. Still have 854 miles. Oh, wow. We got our work cut up. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a whole lot of time either to... So are you gonna drive? You gotta drive all the way to Massachusetts tonight, or are you gonna no, stop? No, no, I stopped tonight. No, but his hours would run out. <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah. I know, I know. I was just, I didn't know and stuff. So. Yeah, no, we. I can generally drive about 650 miles a day, maybe, but I don't generally even drive that many. 620 usually, that's about it. Mm. Yeah. Good enough for me. Yeah, that's all it took. Was for me to know how many hours I could drive. <laughs> yeah, yeah Larry was, uh, my husband was talking about trying to become a truck driver and stuff, but a lot of people told him that with his age now, he won't be able to. Yeah, well, as long as you can pass a physical, it shouldn't be enough. Because he just turned 71 yesterday. Oh, wow. Uh, but he don't even look like it, Rudy. No, he don't. No, I've seen him in videos. <laughs> no. He, he doesn't. I look older than him, and he's a year older than me. So. Oh, wow. Yeah. He still got most of his black hair. Oh, and wow. the only part that, that's natural, I think, is the part back here. That's pretty well grayed out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting older too every day. I'll be 38 next month. Oh wow. He's still young. And he's telling me I got gray hair already, Ruthie. Well, look who you are. <laughs> Wait till I get home and come. <laughs> oh, oh, he, I he knows I love him. I open my mouth, insert foot. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> oh, I'm only 34. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. Now see, it's because of the color of, of Larry's hair. Of uh, truck review box's hair. Yeah. yeah. That, that he looked so old. Especially with the beer. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And because sometimes I look at him and I think he's, you know, he looks older than me, but no, he's not. Yeah. Um, he's just one of the eight cab kids. I mean. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know, Kayla's not looking for the cab. Yeah. She's not. She's uh, doing something else. That's uh, she's driving one of those vans that. You take to the doctors and stuff, and that's it. And you get to keep the band. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Uh, Jeff is still driving. Stanley's still driving. Uh, me and my hubby seen Larry, uh, Stanley at Martin's one day, and he said only two days a week or something like that he's driving. Well, see, I, I don't know any of the new driver's heart. You know Stanley, don't you? Last name? Oh my god. I, I don't think so. I can't. Pam Frumpler is, is still working there and uh, as a dispatcher. Right. Uh, Jeff is still there. Yeah, I know. I know Jeff is there. Uh, but anybody else, I, I don't. I don't know that 
the driver. Because as soon as, you know, I retire, uh, it's been run by two different people. Mm -hmm. So I, I have no connection to anybody that, that is there. When you say Carol, do you mean Carolyn? Carolyn and yeah. Okay, well that's who I taught. Yeah, I go over there sometimes and clean for her. Um, that's what I thought. Yeah. It was Carolyn. Yeah, that is. Hey, honey, what's Stanley's last name? Yeah, Stanley. I had... No, I was just asking uh, what was Stanley's last name because no, uh, we're, really here, we're here at Callahan's likes, and I was asking Ruth if she knew one. She, she says she really likes it. Stanley, the one that drives for the cab. The cab. Well, sometimes I surprise myself because I... Yes, honey. It doesn't sound like honey. me to me. Oh, honey, yeah. I'm here. <laughs> uh, I did. Uh, that, uh, the cab company. I had tried to, to call you to let you know I, I got your... Okay. No, before I got the thing about 45 minutes, I tried yeah. to call. Yeah, okay. And it wouldn't let me go through. Yeah, no, because it's a Canadian number. Uh, yeah. It, cause it, and then it said it was... Oh, okay, you know, honey. Not. And then... I tried calling Larry. Right. So he could call you and okay. let you know that, you yeah. know, that. But yeah, uh, we're here at uh, Callahan's and stuff, and uh, we got some and, uh, drink and uh, stuff, and Rudy's going for a sandwich. It, it, it went crazy. Yeah. Yeah, no. All right, but I'll, what do you, I know, I'll call you when I'm on my way. Oh, wow. Huh. All right. So, right okay, after honey. that. I right, love you, much babe. Longer until you said 45 right, minutes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Larry forgot what it was. Uh, oh. I keep the baby. Yeah. Keep the baby. <laughs> yeah. That's now that's good. my oh, yeah, oldest I saw daughter. That. I and saw that my on Facebook earlier. Yeah. Nice. Grand Great grand baby. Cool. Yeah. I, I replaced the picture of my, my husband. I'm no longer, we don't live together, but we're still married. And have uh, Tina, my youngest daughter, her, her dad. And uh, they're, uh, he's living in Georgia. Uh, down around the coastline uh, with his uh, oldest son and my two grandchildren that he got with him. And so it's a perfect marriage. We're good friends. Oh, wow. That's good. He, he sends calls up here to Pizza Hut and orders pizza. <laughs> Uh, for Mother's Day, he did that, uh, and then he did it for my birthday. Because uh, we were here with Chuck and Angie on, on my birthday. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and I did. Yeah. yeah, Chuck was saying he so kicks his ass because he didn't videotape very much. <laughs> uh, I, I'm just too shaky. If I'm not sitting in front of my computer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're too shaky. Uh, I'm too shaky, and I I have tried taking short videos and stuff around the house. They okay. What do you need for this burger? I'm good. I got everything here. No mustard or mayonnaise. Uh, that would be actually nice. Uh, mayonnaise and mustard. Would be nice. Uh, um, I can't walk good enough. Yeah to hold anything and, you know, without it pouncing back and forth. <laughs> and then okay. when, when I go to take the camera this way, and then when I go to turn it around, and there's just not that much stuff around my house. Yeah. 
Well, looks like I got me my burger here, so they're not going to have anything to eat, so uh, we'll be back, guys. I am now already in Ohio, on the turnpike in Ohio, yeah! We just entered Ohio here a little bit ago, we uh, finally got uh, out of Elkhart, Indiana. Had a nice meeting there with Ruthie uh, Fry and Elizabeth McDonald. <laughs> Yeah, I hope I didn't pronounce the last name uh, incorrectly, but hey. Yeah, that's the way it is. I can't pronounce everybody's name correctly either, so... Well, at least I think I got Elizabeth's name right. <laughs> but yeah, this is the first rest area up here in Ohio, I believe. And we're gonna go probably to the Petro in Perrysburg, Ohio. Probably go down there and... I never did fuel up in South Beloit, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go fuel up over there in Perrysburg. And then I'll probably go in there and grab me a shower and all that good stuff. Now we did have the burger over there, so we're not going to eat again today. Too late in the day anyways, we got probably another 45 minutes and we'll be in Perrysburg, so... We'll just uh, take a shower and fuel up and all that good stuff and then uh, continue on early again tomorrow morning. Although, although today I didn't really get up uh, too early and get her going. I was just kind of lazy today. <laughs> so tomorrow we got to get up a little earlier and go. So because we still have uh, about 720 miles to go I think after we uh, stop up there in Perrysburg tonight and then uh, so we gotta do at least 600 miles to well we don't really have to but I would like to get at least 600 miles in tomorrow if I can that would uh, only leave me with maybe 120 miles the day after so only be about two hour drive so then I wouldn't have to hurry up too much there in the morning to get going so and on top of that, it would leave me with some time if I got to go to Quebec or some place to go pick up a reload. It would make it a little easier for me. Yes, indeed. So let's get on down the road and see how busy it's going to be in Perrysburg. All right, guys, we are at the end of our day today. And as you can see, we have had us a very nice, much needed shower. Yes, indeed. We're here in... Uh, Perry, Perrysburg, Ohio at the Petro. Yeah, and we are done for today. We already finished uh, rendering uh, one video and uh, had a shower, fueled up, and all that good stuff. So we are getting ready to go to bed. So we appreciate you guys uh, tuning in today. And if you like the video, give us a big fat thumbs up. I know we had a special guest on today's show, so. Uh, I appreciate you guys meeting up with me today. That was a lot of fun. Finally got to meet you guys. And with that being said, have a good one everybody. This has been Trucker Rudy signing out. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come.